Hi, it's Game Tate here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the brewery, although I have already done a video. There have been a few small changes, and I just wanted to make a new video because there, that video is very flawed, and I didn't get a chance to do it in the studio. So we'll start with the exterior, like always. Person, there's a person walking in. Holding some money. There's a custom tree with just a, made with just a few pieces. There's kind of a little little walkway right there. And then this homemade lamp post, which I really like. And then another thing that you'll notice is that there is this cobblestone. This is all throughout the city. So that it all matches and it looks a lot better, in my opinion, than the just the gray tiles. All those gray tiles that I got from redoing all my modulars. And including this one, because I built this with the with the dark gray tiles and then I changed it to match everything else. But that was somewhere else. I'll show you later. So there's a nice double doors. Actually, one leads to the kitchen, the other leads to the place where you go to kind of check in. And there's some random little details, like, like right there. And then I use the car pieces, kind of arches, and just some windows, and random slopes, and grids. Uh, kind of, they kind of look like pillars, in a way, but that's just how I see it. Then the rooftop, there has not been very much changed. I guess it fell when I was moving it. But there's a nice bottle there. Just some. There's also a vending machine, sink, some sandwich of some kind, and a little bit of seating. Then of course the sign. That's nice. So, yeah, I know you might be thinking, why is a kid making a Lego brewery? But this is actually more for, like, just a restaurant. And also, they probably have root beer. So, now at the back, there are a little bit of more. It's a little more random, but you don't see this very much. Then there's actually a ladder to get up here, so... I guess only the athletic people can get up there, and their Legos, their, their hands just clamp in, they don't get tired. And then there's a very steep stairway, just held up by a couple of bricks, and then the door actually opens. This is the only big thing wrong with this. The door opens like that. And I got this door to finally open, which is nice. And that'll do it for the exterior. We're going to take a look inside. This is the second floor and the main dining area besides the roof. And there's a little covered bar area. This nice gentleman is waiting there to get some food that this waiter is happily bringing over to him, or actually waitress. Nice big pizza for his golden plate. This guy is just chilling with his T-bone steak, very happy about that. That's the hinged doors where the bar tenders get in. There's just a couple of random little details in there. And then there might be yeah, there are a few seats. I kind of tried to replicate booths, but it didn't work out, so they're just seats. So, I think that's really it for the second floor. There's not as much as some of my other buildings or the LEGO modular sets, so we'll, mo we'll continue moving down. This is the first floor, and... There is not too much to cover down here. There is just some, like a stove, 
water, dishwasher, and some random things stacked up over there. There is one main chef, so this place doesn't have exactly good business. And then there's just a random storage container made of white grill pieces. Then in here is where you go to get your seat, and this waiter will bring you to the seat upstairs or on the roof, depending on your choice and the amount of people. So he's looking, he sees this lady coming, and he's already starting to walk. Then there's this nice little pattern down there. made from the tiles and there's just a little bit of sloping I guess somebody could potentially sit there they would have a hard time not falling off though so I hope you liked this review and tour kind of like more of a redo and I will if you enjoyed this video please be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video King T out